hi guys welcome back again to my channel so today i want to show you something funny and cool uh, i'm exactly in castle dower dungeon in solitude here solitude and i'm in jail because i commit a crime and i'm gonna show you how to escape from this jail and if you have uh, a, lo a lot of lock picks uh, maybe i can i only have one uh, you can try to unlock this. I'm trying now. Oh, uh, I have skeleton key. So actually, you can escape. But there is another way that uh, if you don't have any uh, lock picks at all, or you don't have any skill, a uh, good skill on lock picking, or you don't have skeleton key, you can do this. There is a secret wall over here. You can activate that and you can enter and actually you can escape from the jail and in here you can try to um, get all um, let me see because I have skeleton key so I can uh, try to open this without break any lock picks you know that's really handy to have this and you can try to get all your stuff back see you can get all your stuff back so now I have all my stuff back which is cool and uh, my weapon also back and now it's empty and you can try I'm gonna put candlelight because it's pretty dark you can try to walk around here because you see you can find this steel sword and you can find this for stamina that's cool and maybe we can find something here the axe if you want but it's very I have a better weapon than that but actually you can sell it if you want and also money and mm, in here there is a stair that you can enter this manhole you're gonna get out from this uh, dungeon so you are outside see that is cool but you cannot enter the this manhole again so but I have a trick also that you can enter from the manhole so I'm gonna show you how So now I'm gonna show you how to enter the manhole. Uh, so after uh, you are in solitude, after this big uh, door over here, the big gate, and all you have to do just keep walking. And by the way, um, there is a barrel over here, but it's empty. But uh, you can also take something from here. Uh, there is kind of cool stuff also, but yeah, I already. Uh, take all of them but you can try to search uh, this barrel too and maybe you will get something cool so um, we try to keep walking here As hello I dude of the nine divines, I bid you and between this store and that blacksmith try to stand here and it's kind of glitch by the way so it's kind of cool that I found it by coincidence so try to jump here in the edge of this stuff and you are in the roof right now in the top of the roof and you can see there is a manhole over here but you cannot enter it again and I reload my save so is everything reset so you cannot enter the manhole all you have to do try to prepare the shout sprint you have to prepare the shout sprint and jump here so you are now exactly on top of the small roof over here and try to aim between this house and that house there is a gap over there try to aim exactly in the between and you're gonna fall that is uh, okay that is normal and you are now exactly I'm gonna put the um, candlelight because it's pretty dark and you're gonna you are exactly under solitude I mean that is 
really really awesome and by the way there is also a secret chest over there see underneath that store but I tried to I want to get some stuff from that but it doesn't work with me I try to let my followers stand there and take all chests um, take all stuff from the chest but it doesn't work so I really don't know how maybe if you guys have some tips or tricks maybe you can let me know so now we focus with um, the manhole over there so you walk here uh, that is the main door the solitude door and uh, from there try to aim a little bit to the left from my from my point of view and that is the horse hat hanging out and the manhole is over here see you could see two a um, manhole over here and that exactly underneath that uh, that lid you know that um, that I was standing right there if you guys could remember and that is exact we are exactly underneath that uh, that manhole so I'm gonna try to go inside actually this is not very important I mean it's nothing cool from this you cannot find some cool stuff or something and you can also exit again by going out this stair but again once you out you cannot go in again so how to go in that's exactly what I just showed to you uh, using a glitch uh, on Skyrim and here uh, because I reset everything because I reload my save so you can take this uh, coin and there is also a weapon over there and uh, here the, the, for the stamina and this chest is empty because if you in jail uh, your stuff gonna be in here so it's not very important and you can steal from uh, only cabbage who, who wants that <laughs> okay nothing here and yeah you can open this wall from the other side that's really cool and voila you are inside the jail room again i mean and you can try to open this if you want to to practice your lock picking skill and voila you are outside again and remember that door is exactly there so this is the uh, point you know that underneath the flag and one door after that so in here so yeah and uh, by the way if you want to focus to master or level up your lock picking skill this is the awesome place to do because you can try to open all these doors with your lock picks or your uh, skeleton key if you have it since I still have my skeleton key over here I don't return it yet <laughs> because I want to keep this shit. I mean, it's so cool. I mean, you don't need lock picks at all. With this skeleton key, you can open all chests or all doors who um, have a mastered, uh, like this mastered level. Uh, because if you use lock picks, it's gonna destroy your lock picks easily. And um, yeah, if you run out from that, and then you have to buy it or you have to steal it. And by the way, if uh, you're using skeleton key, you also can level up. So I will show you. I'm gonna open this with skeleton key because it's added level, so it's very easy. Over here. Okay, it's opened. And this one is already open and this one is master level and it's really soft because every time you do this your lockpick is just destroyed uh, very easy I mean with the skeleton key it's not easy to get broken okay that's why it's very cool to keep it um, for a while I hope I could keep it forever but yeah it's um, sadly not so I'm gonna open this one Oh shit, I didn't know that. I didn't know what that. Say you in your okay, I'm gonna. I'm <laughs> Damn. <laughs> okay, oh, it's too gold. That is very. I I'm rich. All your problems with the gods go away. But it cost you. What do you say? Okay, take my, Just take my money. Now, move along before you get me in trouble. Ah, okay. Uh, it's my mistake because I using candlelight spell so he could see me. 
but okay we try next door i hope okay but i have to be quick okay this one is open see lock picking increased to 81 so you still can level up your lock picking skill even with skeleton key so to get this yum oh man it's been a while ago um i kind of forget this let me see because i'm using ear this one this uh, mission and as i remember correctly uh because it's been a while ago to get skeleton key i guess you have to focus with nightingale uh mission so um this one the darkness return this the darkness returns this mission i have to use skeleton key and big chance that i'm gonna lose my skeleton key so that's why i don't focus this mission yet because i want to uh, try to abuse this stuff you know this key to level up my lock picking skill without uh, use any lock picks at all and i could uh, open the chest or door with the master level easily with skeleton key over uh, here so it's cool stuff very very cool stuff that's all guys thank you for watching i wish you have a great day and see you soon bye bye